After months of searching, the city of Davenport has hired a full-time city attorney. This all started last November when the city announced former city attorney Tom Warner's plans to retire. Maddie Franz is in studio tonight breaking down how we got to this point. Hey, Maddie. Hi, John. A lot has happened in the last year. Now, Warner left the city at the start of the year. And on that same day, Mayor Mike Matson issued an executive order appointing Assistant City Attorney Brian Heyer as the Interim Corporation Counsel. That means he was the acting city attorney. Then in March, City Council considered an agreement to give Heyer a $50,000 bonus once his work as Interim Corporation Counsel finished. They delayed that decision three times. And before Council could vote, the City announced Heyer's plans to retire at the end of April. Since then, the City hasn't had an in-house attorney. That changed just a few hours ago when city council agreed to hire its new city attorney. Well, appointing a corporate council for the city of Davenport is the first step in the right direction. After more than six months, the city of Davenport has a permanent city attorney again. So we have one item. Uh, it's a resolution appointing Mr. Samuel Hupp as the city of Davenport's corporate council. City council met for a special session to hire Samuel Huff IV at a base salary of $195,000. Interim city administrator Mallory Merritt detailed the hiring process, which took about three months. In April of 24, a CBNA uh, was awarded the contract for both of these recruitments. She says the recruiting agency spoke to city officials and reviewed the salaries of similar positions across the Midwest. And the recruiter ran comps for the council at that range being 160 to 220. Elder woman at large Jasmine Newton says the city also asked its external legal counsel about the salary range. And we were told that it's certainly within range. The recruiting agency offered the city six candidates for additional interviews. That formal interview process included a comprehensive city tour, a elected official panel, uh, a stakeholder kind of staff panel, Ultimately, city leaders chose Huff as the best fit for the job. I would say that the majority of the panelists that were involved supported the candidate that's been put forward. According to the employment agreement, Huff will receive $250 a month for a car allowance and another $150 a month as a business allowance. That's a total of nearly $5,000 a year. John? All right, thanks, Maddie. The same recruiting agency is searching for a new city administrator to replace Mallory Merritt, who is in the role on an interim basis. She plans to leave the position on August 16th.